Right, so hey everyone and welcome back to another budget photography video. So, a few days ago I put this video out on TikTok. And I was pretty happy with it. It was a pretty good video, to be fair. But I thought I'd show you guys how I actually made it. So we are going to hop into our editing software and we are going to make that video. Now, what I will say is all sounds in that video were fake. None of it was real. No audio was real. I downloaded the sounds from a website that I use called Epidemic. It's a really good company. You pay like £10 a month and you get music, sound effects and lots of other different things. So let's have a look at what we've got here. So I've got some clips here. So what do we have here at this one? Uh, no, I don't really like that one. All of this was actually recorded on my iPhone 12 mini at 120 frames a second. So that's the first clip. So we want that there. And then this is the second clip. So I'm gonna put that at about there. And then what's this one? I think this might be, okay. This is just where I actually, um... yeah, I was originally going to use my own sound effects, um, but I didn't like the clicking that was actually coming out of the camera. So we've got to put in different ones. So. We will then go with this last clip here and we'll put that maybe just there. And we're going to mute all three of these because we don't want any sound. Let's have a look at that quickly. Actually, let's unmute them so we can hear it all. Stretch that out. So that obviously needs to be slowed down a little bit more, especially at the beginning there. So what we'll do is we're going to mute that track to about there. So I'm going to cut there because what I want to do is I want to slow it down back to 120. And then now what we'll do, we'll have another look at that. So again, we're going to mute it all just because we don't really need any sound now. So here we go. This is, let's put my pencil down because I don't need that. So we need to, before we do any sound altering, what we need to do is we need to go through this. So maybe about, because we don't really want to see me rising it up again, bringing, because we don't want to see me bringing up the camera twice. So I think we'll cut it at about there. And I do feel like if that goes on a little bit too long, maybe I could speed that up a little bit. Just about there, maybe. Because I do like that transition, but I feel like if it goes on for too long, so it will speed it up a little bit more. Bring that in closer. And we'll watch back again. Maybe what I'll do then, I'll bring this forward more. Bring that there. About there. See, this is what a lot of this kind of TikTok stuff is. It's just repeatedly going over things over and over and over and over again. Yeah, you see, that doesn't make any sense because it's just... Now, 
There we go. That's perfect. I like that. That's, that's, yeah. That's good. Right, now we can focus on the rest of this clip. So, I'm going to keep the length of this because we're going to need it for the audio tracks. Then we need to be able to show what I'm actually videoing. So, we're going to go with this clip here, which is the duck. Now, I don't really want the duck there for very long, so I'm going to bring that to about there. And we're going to watch over the clip to make sure it all makes sense and it, you know, it actually tells a story of what I'm doing. So, yeah, so far I'm pulling the camera up. There would be click, 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 click. And I didn't mute that track. That's my fault. I'm going to bring that forward a little bit more because it goes on for a little bit too long there. But to be fair, so does the duck. Uh, the swan, sorry. So, there we go. At the beginning there, we do actually have it going normal uh, 24 frames a second, which we don't really want. So, I am going to cut that bit off and move it forward. And then... And then I think we'll just watch again. So yeah, we'll have the click, 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 click. Going off. Yeah, 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 yeah. So there we go. We got about a 17 second clip. That's perfectly fine. It's not too long. It's not too short. But that obviously doesn't include any audio. So we need to go into our files and go into our downloads where all of the music and the sound effects where I've stored from Epidemic Sound are. So what I'm going to do here is I'm actually going to put in the music first. Now obviously the music isn't 17 seconds long. So we're going to cut it at 17 seconds. Just there. And we'll get rid of that. So now we can watch it back. Turn it down a little bit. There. Yeah. Now that is exactly what we want. That looks pretty damn good. The volume seems okay at the moment. Then we'll get in the wind just here. We'll put that apparently not there. Then we'll get the wind and we'll just put that there. Like that. And we can have a look at that. Now that is too loud. Are we going to cut it at 17 seconds again? Because we don't need anything past that. Now that is very, very loud. So we're going to quieten that all the way down. And we're going to lift the music. And that was too loud. On the music's part. There we go, and that's that gives it that outdoor feel. Just like that. Now we need to add in the camera shutters. Now this is going to be a little bit difficult because these are so, so small to actually add in. So I'm going to zoom into the project more, just like that. And then we're going to find the bit where it would be reasonable that I would be clicking the shutter, you know, the button. So about here. So this is where I'm going to start to put my shutter sound effects. And this is what they sound like. It's only one um, shutter click, so that's fine. We're going to put about mm, 10 in, maybe. I'm going to zoom out. 
or as many as I think I'm going to need. But in the original one that I made, I put about 10 in. So I'm going to keep going to make it sound like a burst of photos. So let's have a look at that. Let's go back again and we'll watch. Because I might have done it too early, I might have done it too late. We don't know. Okay, so they were too quiet. So we need to raise the volume. And we'll go again. This time they're too loud. So we can bring that down maybe to about there. Let's just listen to the just the clicks. Perfect. That's exactly how I wanted them. But maybe a little bit. Can we go on for a little bit longer? Let's go back. Yeah, I could fit a few more in there. Let's have a look again. Maybe one more. There we go. Now, because we're near a lake, we need some water sounds. So, I've got one just here. ES Boat Wave Special Effects. I'm going to put that in just there below the shutter sounds. Again, we're going to cut it off at about 17 seconds. And we're going to listen to it. So it obviously is too loud. We need to bring the volume down and listen again. Now it's too quiet, so we need to... It does have a problem. It's too fast. This is all being shown in, you know, slow motion. So we need to select the sound as going slower. Just like that. So now we need to um, cut the track down again. There we go. And let's have a have a listen so far. There we go. And then I think that that sounds pretty good. It's not, you know too quiet or too loud or anything like that and then because this is obviously a lake we need to bring in some wildlife and we can do that with city park ambience just here that i've just selected we have a listen to that So you can hear all the different birds, the different animals that are there. I'm going to slow it down again. I'm going to cut, delete that. But we're going to slow it down a little bit just because we kind of need to. To make it sound more authentic. Turn, turn the volume down on it. I feel like the shutter sound is too loud now. I have just turned it down a little bit. Now, now it feels too quiet. Hmm. There we go. That's perfect. That is perfect to how I'd want it. So that is literally all of the sound design for this one little tiny TikTok, pretty much. Let's um, let's watch it back, shrink that, and let's watch it. Nice.
yeah, there we go. I am personally happy with that. I would net go to export. And then we can export that in 4K. Not that TikTok actually accepts 4K, but I'd rather, you know, export in 4K and then have TikTok compress it than, you know, export in 720p and then it gets to compressed even more to like 440p and that is exporting really quickly. I was expecting it to export that quickly. Anyway guys, thanks for joining me in this video and I'll see you in the next one.